It is not yet clear what has caused this gruesome affliction. The local government's Ministry of Defense erected a quarantine wall shortly after the outbreak. The global relief effort's steady stream of supply drops has sustained what few survivors remain in the city. The Ministry of Defense believes more radical action should be taken to stem the tide of this virus. The question is, are there still non-infected survivors in the city as the GRE maintains? And if so, will the ministry still go through with a stated plan to annihilate the city in an attempt to wipe out the Haran virus once and for all? Whether by way of the virus or the ministry's proposed plan, one thing is certain. Haran's days are numbered. Hello guys and welcome to uh, my Dying Light playthrough, been really looking forward to this game, uh, well I was really looking forward to it, still am, uh, except I have been told that it's kind of spooky, the, no the night times are kind of spooky, which is, um, I don't particularly like jump scares, so, and I thought this was more of a, like, a funnish kind of zombie, zombie game, I love zombies, don't like jump scares. So this could be a very exciting let's play because if 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 people are just scaring me, I don't know. Um, so yeah, but if they're not and it is terrifying, I will shit myself, uh, and that will be live. That will be you'll be hearing that. So just for that excitement alone, let's get stuck in. Uh, I've just got to sort out the options. <coughs> Make sure the old subtitles is on, if there is any. On, there we go, thank you. Enable hints, I'll, I'll allow hints to be enabled. Um, I think I'll keep this all pretty much the same. Right, so, here we go. In the game, yes please. Choose your difficulty level, normal or hard. I think we'll go for normal. <laughs> I think we'll definitely go for normal. Got no idea what this is gonna be like. So, uh, here we go. Activated. Commence briefing. Approaching Iran. Data on the subject. Kadir Suleiman. A local political figure hired to maintain order after the outbreak. His brother Hassan died in a disease-related incident before we were able to evacuate him. Suleiman blamed the GRE for Hassan's death. He stole a highly sensitive file which became his bargaining chip against the GRE, with instructions to publicize it if anything happened to him. Data on the subject. The stolen file. Yep, in 10 it details the incomplete process of synthesizing a cure for the virus. If implemented in its current state, the produced substance may be extremely toxic. Now. Also, the file contains full description of the virion structure. Any attempt to use it would result in countless lives lost. It must be recovered. Further information, current status. Suleiman sent the file to an associate unknown to us with instructions to publicize it at his command at any time. To counter that, we instituted a citywide communication jam, preventing him from publicizing the file. Your GRE-issued radio can overcome that jamming. It is your lifeline. Do not lose it. Suleiman has since gone underground and begun using a different name. We have reason to believe he now leads one of the two main factions operating within the city. You are to find Suleiman and locate the stolen file in order to save mankind from a disaster of unprecedented proportions. That wasn't a normal drop shoot. Break his legs, then take him to rides. Back up! All of you! Stop! Loud noises draw them. Fall back! Fall back! Oh, <sighs> 
Okay, well, a lot of hit shit hit the uh, hit the fan there, the metaphorical fan, but a lot of shit here. Um, I didn't start as, as as kindly as I thought it might. Well, to be fair, I didn't think it was going to start kindly at all. But wow. Right, well, let's continue. <laughs> you pinch him. You're scared. Not scared. Then pinch him. He blinked. What? He blinked again. What if he's a zombie? Ah! Zombie! Run! <sighs> Right, well, here we are, to move and R to look around. Um, initially, biggest thing, graphics, fucking amazing already. Um, <coughs> I'm pretty new uh, to the one and to its uh, games. Um, but yeah, oh my god, shit hot. Uh, so yeah, I'm going to look around. Alien zombies from Mars closer than you think. Evil massacre. Hands free. Um, so despite the predicament that they're in, they're, 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 they've still got zombie stuff up, like it's gone out of fashion. Uh, oh hello, Jade of the sc uh, Scorpion, uh, Jade the Scorpion Aldem Aldemir, Aldemir, meet the free time kickboxing world champion, Haran King's Hall. Ooh. Oh wow. Look at that! Oh, I've been so excited to play this game for so freaking long. Um, that is amazing. That that's oh, all I can say. Um, don't know what the exploration is going to be like in this game, quite frankly. Um, I would assume quite high, uh, but well, if, yeah, I, th I think it's got to be quite high, surely, because we'll be getting supplies and all that type of stuff. So. Um, yeah, very exciting. I will be exploring as much as possible. Um, big fan of it. Uh, as you can probably tell from the uh, Fallout videos that are being released. Right, let's move on. So we got uh, what we got? Some pictures, general general pictures here. Any pictures of who we are? Or, well, why would there be pictures of who we are? Come on, don't be an idiot. Oh, look at that. That's a, that's a happy photo, isn't it? That's a happy photo. Not so happy. Not so happy. Well, I'm not quite sure what the hell that's. Yeah, okay. Oh, little, little dog. Little dog. Um, okay. Oh, hello. Some flash up? Yes, it did. Turn on the radio. Yes, please. I just, oh, I've got to look outside once more. Look at that. How can you not rate that as one of the most beautiful things you ever did see in the game? Um, to be fair, I'm kind of gutted that we're not going to get another Bioshock because, uh, well, we might do, but chances are very, very slim. 
uh, considering the uh, what we know about the developers closing down the company and stuff but you know because basically what I was going to say is if we did have Bioshock and we had uh, this generation of consoles oh my god it would look spectacular like imagine infinite for god's sake oh oh god all right here we go come on surely there's got to be some stuff it's not going to allow me to take anything okay the time time's 9.49 don't know if that's going to be relevant that's all what we got to do right let's move on I'm kind of gutted by the lack of oh hello oh bit of feed action Whee. Right, here we go, let's move on. Oh, a bit dark in here, a bit dark in here. We've got a switch, we've got a switch. No, okay. Shit, the brick. Right. What's behind me? Nothing's behind me. Okay. Shoes. Shoes everywhere. Crap everywhere. It's not. Oh, same photo. Is that exactly the same photo as the one we've got in here? Yep. <laughs> They obviously they like to uh, put up the same photo in this family, don't they? Oh, cat this time. Let's, let's have a bit of difference with a pussy. <coughs> What's this one? Same poster. Wow, what we were. Oh, Christ alive. You sleep for three days like a dead man, then scare children. Off to a great start, Daddy. Where am I? In paradise, can't you see? Okay, enough joking around. Head to room 190. The boss will brief you. What do you mean, 31? Ask the boss. I'm glad he asked, because I got seriously confused. Go see the boss in room 190. The orange circle on the main map is your objective. Sick. Come on, give me some, give me some, like, a reward for exploration. Come on. Where, 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 let me grab something. Let me take something. Look at that, can't get in there. Can we talk to you? Chinwag? Fancy, fancy. Telling me what the fuck is going on? Right. Oh, what you've 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 told me everything and you've told me nothing there. I, I'm, not, I'm not quite sure what to do with that. You've, you've told me what I needed to know, but at the same time, you've told me absolutely nothing. Um, oh, hello, 18. Okay, right, we've got 18 there, we've got 18. So, could I assume that in this room is the number 18, which could be the woman we're talking... Oh, hello, hello, oi oi. Cheeky, cheeky chin work, cheeky chin work, no. Oh, she does not look, that's probably why. He's, 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 oh, look at her. So I'm getting a kind of like hospitally kind of medical vibe. Um, like possibly the numbers equate to how injured a person is or diseased a person may be. I'm not sure. A little bit of guesswork. You right there, mate? Yeah, kicking around the can. God, fun and jokes in this, eh? What were you saying? Gonna get a meal oh, someone's not happy that I survived. I'm gonna, I'm gonna guess that's gonna be the general vibe. That no one's gonna be quite happy that I got, I basically got a mere killed, didn't I? Essentially, if, it if they weren't saving me. Oh, I feel, I feel like that's a bit creepy, isn't it? I'm, I'm facing a man who's sleeping. Bit, bit weird. Bit weird. Go to the angry man. Oi! Oi! You little shit. <laughs> you survived and said there me here. Oh, hello. Oh, Derek. Let's have a word. Hey, where's room 190? Upstairs. Well, thanks for that. Enlightening conversation. Um, yeah, like I say, I'm very surprised that I can't nick stuff. But, I'm a sh but essentially, I'm living here. So I suppose, why would I want to? Um... But hey, you never know. Never know, I might, I might need to disappear. Right, what's that? A number number? 181. 
Okay, so we're going to 190. So we're 18 again. What is all this about? Sick bay. Sick bay. Ooh. And you are? Crane. Uh, 31. Oh, right. Um, how's your head? My head? Got it. Listen up. Until the boss says so, you are not on the list. So go talk to him ASAP and let's get things moving. Now, if you'll excuse me. How do you feel today? What list? What goddamn list? Right, okay. So I, I went all the way around there for the sake of this door. Thanks a lot, mate. Um, so, okay, so we're on floor 18? Floor 18, possibly? But, yeah, okay, it might be floor 18. Here we go. Headquarters. Well, that sounds promising, doesn't it? Oh, yeah. In fact, the mini-map is showing that is the place to go. 19. Yep, so it must be floor. Okay. Um, do I have a look around before I go in? Yeah, I probably will. Let's have a look. So, one-on-one. -on -one, so, they're just room numbers, and the big numbers are just floor numbers. So, my little theory already tired and old and wrong, most importantly. Oh, check a load of that. A lot of fans. It's very hot in Hamas. Hassan. Ham Hamas. Hassan. I can't even remember where we are already. Kia now. Can I talk to you? Yep. Out for a chat? Oi. Mate. I know that's depressing. I know there's a zombie apocalypse. Come on, son. You can, you can be a bit... I'm assuming the uh, the square that keeps coming up is obviously gonna gotta be auto save, and I'm quite happy because it is auto saving a hell of a lot. Um, whether that will continue to do that, I don't know, but I'm I'm a fan of a uh, of a an, an auto save that saves a lot. I hate the type of games where you'll 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 get quite far in and then realise there's there's not been a save for ages, but you kind of want to finish up. Oh, hey, oh look at that. Worked out how to crawl, it didn't even tell me how. Hello, look at that. Oh, I can't, can't see it. Kind of looks like an Olympic building over there. Look at that, check that out. Very nice. Right, let's move on. Guards in there. Oh, hello, I can go in the guards. Look, I can't do shit till they get new bolts from downstairs. Right. right. Let's go talk to the bar, the boss, the boss. In room one nine zero. Let's go. Big fan of this. Um, big fan of the old uh, world champion uh, boxer, aren't they? Kickboxer. Jesus. Oh, different photos. Same cat. Different photos, a bit spooky. Different wedding couple. A lot of lot of married couples in this building, isn't there? A lot of married couples. Married couples with cats or dogs. That's it in the general theme thus far. Oh. Any notes that I can read? No. Oh, hello. No. I do kind of feel like a lot of this stuff I could click, I just haven't worked out how to. But I would assume that it would come up if I could. It's there, you know. I just can't. Oh, hello, look at this. Oh, right. Oh, bit of TV. Remember, kids, scroll. Aim for the head. Stay tuned to this station for more information updates. Aim for the head. So they're going for that traditional zombie uh, thing. Um, oh, okay. So is that the hospital thing? Night and day for you is working night and day for you. Oh, okay. Phone, phone center. Wakey, wakey, eggs and <laughs> loud noises attract zombies. Be quiet or you'll buy it. However, your right to defend yourself does not allow for random or unprovoked attacks against infected. A good zombie is a dead zombie. No shit. No shit. Any more? Remember, kids, don't go out after dark. I 
I can't see us not being able to go out after dark. Well, we're not kids, I suppose, uh, would be the argument. Quite right, a good argument to make, but hey, I, I equally wouldn't want to go out at night. Be responsible. Globby the Global Relief Elephant. <laughs> Globby. What a name. Report suspected zombies, even family members. So what I don't understand, zombie bites, see something, say something. So normally with zombies, if you're bitten, that's the end, quite frankly. Like, that's it. You, you chop the arm off straight away or you're dead. I'm assuming that we haven't chopped off my arm because you'd see your arm by now. Like, I know we haven't seen the arm, but you would naturally know if your arm was missing. Um, so by that assumption, I can either assume that they, this place has got something that can sort you out when you've been bitten, uh, or this game is going for a type of zombies that doesn't quite have the same, same vibe. But who knows? We're, we're going to find all this out for sure, for sure. But nothing like getting a bit of guesswork before you start. What is that? Well, you can't make out anything on that, can you? Little a little head over here. Some a football pitch. A couple of tennis courts. <laughs> and a load of googly googly writing. Right, let's go out. Oh, didn't realise that was even a fucking door. Here we go. Hey, I'm looking for the Are you the boss? What, am I too young? You got the problem with my age? No, I you wanted to talk to me? That's better. Do you remember anything? Know what you are? Yeah, I can, I can see this is some kind of shelter. We call it the Tower. Brecken and his runners put it all together a couple of months ago, and we've been here ever since. Hunting airdrops, scavenging, and rescuing people. Yeah, I, I wanted to thank that girl. Good, because if not for her, you'd already be chewing somebody's knee bone. Your Anderson was totally crushed, by the way. Only thing Jade could salvage was your radio. Oh, great. So can I get that back, please? Actually, I think I need it more than you do. Believe me, pal, that's not the case. Fine. Take it. You know why runners put their lives in danger? For guys like you. So now you take the antisin meant for someone else, and you won't even share your gear with us? I don't have time to deal with your bullshit. I've lost contact with one of our guys thanks to the fucked up radios we're stuck with. Do something for me, would you? I don't want to see you or your precious radio anymore. So go be useful somewhere else. We don't tolerate lazy assholes here in the tower. Hey, be fair. I'm not, I'm not lazy. I'm just, hey, boss. Save it. That lost guy I mentioned, he's only on the 13th floor. But he might as well be trapped in a mine cabin. Come back later. And I'm not the boss. Too young, remember? I'm Rahim. Brecken's in charge here. 